Today I'm going to be making this deliciously spicy pork ramen. Welcome back to our kitchen where we show you how to make delicious family friendly recipes. One of our daughter Gracie's absolute favourite meals is ramen and today I'm going to show you how to make this slow cooked spicy pork ramen. I've got my oven preheating to 150C or 300F and now we're going to prepare the pork. Add one tablespoon of olive oil to a large casserole pan and heat on a high heat. I've got a one kilogram or 2.2 pound rolled pork shoulder here and I'm going to season that with quarter of a teaspoon each of salt and pepper and then place it in the pan. Cook the pork for four to five minutes, turning a couple of times to ensure it's sealed on all sides. Once the pork's sealed, pour in two litres or eight and a half cups of chicken or vegetable stock. Then add in an onion that's been sliced in half, no need to peel, a carrot, a stick of celery that's been broken in half, three cloves of garlic and a thumb sized piece of ginger. Then add two tablespoons of mirin or rice wine vinegar, three tablespoons of soy sauce, two tablespoons of gochujang paste and a red chilli that's been roughly sliced. Give everything a stir and bring to the boil, then place the lid on the pan and place in the oven for four hours. Check on the pork two or three times during the cooking process and top up with a little bit of boiling water if needed. You need to have at least a litre of liquid left by the time the pork finishes cooking. Take the pan out of the oven and place the pork on a chopping board. Shred the pork using two forks, discarding any large pieces of fat. Place a sieve over a large bowl and strain the cooking liquid. Place the pork and the liquid back in the pan. Leave on a low heat to keep warm and now we're going to fry off some sliced leeks and spinach. Heat a tablespoon of olive oil in a frying pan over a medium to high heat. Add the sliced leek and season with a pinch of salt and pepper, then fry for five minutes, stirring a couple of times. During the last minute, move the leek to one side of the pan and add 100 grams or three packed cups of baby spinach and allow to wilt. Now it's time to assemble the ramen. We'll start by placing some cooked ramen noodles in your bowls. I've got 500 grams or 17 and a half ounces of cooked ramen noodles and that'll serve four people. Top with the hot broth and the shredded pork. Then add the cooked leeks and spinach. Top with some chopped spring onions or scallions, some julienne carrots, a couple of soft boiled eggs chopped in half and finish with a pinch of black and white sesame seeds and some chilli flakes. That's my spicy slow cooked pork ramen, full of those umami flavours and perfect for a weekend dinner. <laughs> 